It's not a ban. It's just a forced sell to a U.S. company. While factually true, it might as well just be considered a ban because ByteDance is not going to sell it. And we're also not considering, even if ByteDance did want to sell their subsidiary TikTok, the Chinese government could just say no. Which they probably would. Logically, they would. Put yourself in the shoes of the Chinese government for a second. If you heard that the U.S. was going to ban one of your most popular apps if you don't give it to them, you would say, yeah, screw you, just ban it. We're not going to give you the app. TikTok harbors a ton of user data. It's got a super powerful algorithm. China's not just going to want to give that over to the U.S. because they asked for it. And if the Chinese government complied, what message does that send to the U.S.? If you want something, just threaten to ban it and they'll be forced to give it to you. Not exactly the best political move for them.